Hey guys, so as you can read and as you can tell, I don't have makeup on. I'm going to be doing festive makeup. But instead of doing the voiceover and being a fake beauty guru here on YouTube, I thought it'd be funnier if my friend who's an actual makeup artist for like film and TV and recently got nominated for Mulan International Film Festival for makeup and has done stuff for like Netflix and Funny or Die with our friend Tim would do my voiceover because I don't know how to do makeup. Now I am not artistically inclined, so this is going to be great. Hope you're excited, because I sure am not. Hey you guys, it's me, Olivia Marie, and I'm prepping my canvas by moving all that hair out of my face. Here we go. Oh, Makeup Forever HD stick. Really, really great. Awesome. What's her color? She's got a tan, so it doesn't match her forehead. Y356? Alright, let's go. Alright, we're dotting our face. We're going in. We're going in. We're evenly distributing like a good girl. Oh yeah. Look at her go. She's doing a good job. Oh, oh my gosh, she's choking that brush. That brush is literally going eh, 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 right now as she's freaking spinning it around. Whew, girl, that brush is dirty too. You need to wash that. You know, I don't even know how you're blending it with how dirty that is. Oh my. Well, she's still blending. She got a little on her eyebrows, but that's okay. I think. No. I mean, I don't. Oh, is she, can she blend it out with how dirty that brush is? Yes, yeah, she can. Okay, there she goes. Good, she's blending into her hairline. And she's going. Yep. She's spackling this on. Oh, wow, that's a dirty palette. Um, oh, <laughs> she's using her fingers now. Really smudging on that dirt. I mean, contour. I mean, at least her placement is right for her face shape, but what? Whoa, I don't really think she needed an extra layer of that. But, oh, uh, <laughs> she's putting it on. All right, so we're still contouring. We're doing it, we're shaping our beautiful face. And now we're gonna blend. Let's go, oh, we're blending back and forth, back and forth, very aggressively. And we're going down for some reason. We are giving ourselves the Skeletor look. You're supposed to go up. Why are you going down? So we're still going down. Um, now we're gonna look dead. That's the look we want, dead. It's a deer after an accident. All right, so we're still blending. This brush is more clean, which I'm very surprised, but, oh, we're still going down. Why are we going down? That's not blended at, oh, now we give up and we're using our finger. Okay, adding a little highlight now, but our brush is dirty, so you can see it's all kind of muddy. And we're still going in. We're highlighting our whole forehead for some reason. We're only supposed to do the center. Sometimes not even no highlighter at all, but yep, we're just rubbing it now. We give up on our brush. We're being lazy. Wow, that is, well, we're blending with our hands now. Why? <laughs> Why? Okay, yep, she realized it's still not blended, so she's still going back in to blend more. It's because she put too much. <laughs> and she knows she did. That's why she made that face. And we're still... This contour is taking longer than the actual makeup itself. Wow. I didn't know it took this long to blend. Okay, now we're going in to contour our nose a little bit to give us that really festive reindeer look. And we're patting. We're blending with our fingers now because again, we give up. Adding that highlighter to our nose. Wow, we really look dead. Olivia, what have you done? <laughs> All right, we're looking really contoured now. We are Kim K over here, looking good. We're not done blending, but we're still gonna set our face anyway with way too much powder. We only need the top and then to pat it in, but Olivia keeps deciding to go back in. And look, we're not all the way blended. What have you done? We still need more. Even more powder, even though that is a matte setting powder. Okay, now we're going with a white NYX stick to make dots on our face? I mean, if we're being a female deer, which is a doe, doe a deer, they don't have spots on their face. They have spots on their butts. But, okay. We're making our spots. Very beautifully. I mean, that one doesn't look like a spot. 
Okay, never mind. We're erasing it because we don't like it. And uh, and dears wear liquid lipstick, obviously. So we're putting on our liquid lipstick. This brand in particular is not good to put more than one or two layers on. And Olivia's going in and in, so she's gonna have really cakey lips. Okay. And now we're gonna go in and make ourselves a little more dear lip with the contour palette. And we're adding that to our lips. This looks very 90s right now. Oh, she's making sure it looks good. She messed up, she hates it. She's wiping off some layers because it was too thick. All right, she just ate some chocolate pudding. Looking good, chocolate pudding. And then she got some on her bottom, so she's caking on more Ooh, of that liquid lipstick. And now we're gonna use our expensive Besame lipstick and make an expensive red nose because we got money. Money, honey. All right. We're making that nose. Rudolph is very expensive. He got the whole team on his back. And we're shaping this nicely with a brush I've actually never seen before in her collection. So did you get a new brush, Olivia? I'm proud of you. And we're doing really good. This is the best I've seen her draw so far. Good technique, taking her time. What's this? Uh, we're putting white, but we're not even putting it on the red part where it's supposed to look shiny. Why did you do that? All right, <laughs> we are uh, blending out our eye with some crease colors, but it kind of looks like a kindergarten art project. You can't rush beauty, Olivia. Um, I don't know what this part is. I'm not sure. Is this supposed to be a cut crease? Wow. Kindergarten. Olivia. She's blending it out now. It's like a cream eyeshadow. Okay. It's looking a little better. I don't see the difference though. And she's, yep. Rubbing away, rubbing away. Wow. Art. Another NYX pencil. This is a green. We're gonna make our eyebrows green with the tip. Why didn't you just use the whole pencil? Oh. Okay, well we're doing a gradient green eyebrow. We should have just blocked out our eyebrows with that spackle foundation, but we didn't. So it's just gonna have some whole green eyebrows with our sad, sad tip. Okay, she did it. And we're using our Q-tips, that's really normal. Uh, normal makeup artists use Q-tips too. She's cleaning it up. Maybe she should do that to her whole face. Cause it's pretty messy. Okay. Good, she cleaned it up. And now, she's cleaning up this concealer to make it look sharp whenever you, oh, oh, she got some red on her. Rest in peace. She's never gonna get that off with that expensive Besame lipstick that is stained for good. Is that a dolphin? Is she making a dolphin? This video just got way more aquatic. Oh, it's a Santa hat, okay. That makes more sense. That would fit. I mean, that's actually the best drawing. I changed my mind. That is the best drawing I've seen her do on her face or on anything. Wow, looking good. I think this is the only part I like so far of this whole look, is how perfect the Santa hat looks. Good job. Very artistic. We're making a little bottom with a cute little fuzzy. And now we're gonna do a white eyeliner. Oh, you rolled out your pencil too far. Don't do that. <laughs> we're doing the inner of our eye and the outer. Trying to make a wing, but this isn't sharp enough, so we'll try our best. Oh, it's okay, we're fixing it with the red. There we go, there's our wing. Wow, and those are even too? Sharp, you know, you, you ripped off the top of your green by doing that. Where's your sharpener? Okay, we're making mistletoe now. I think that's mistletoe, is that mistletoe? Or is that a tree? 
Is that a tree? Yeah, well, yep, mistletoe. Looking good. All right. Wow. Was this a look or what? So she's doing her mascara now, really nice mascara, and it's really hard to mask that up, so 